Would you like explosions? How about giant robot suits? If you answered yes to either of those questions, then boy, do I have good news for you. We've got an in-depth look at how the long-awaited MechWarrior 5 mercenaries will make things go boom in spectacular fashion. And if you don't like those things, well, then I'm just not sure how to help you. Developer Piranha Games tells me it's going all out on making the damage you can deal in MechWarrior 5 look and feel amazing. As your mech's arms, legs, shoulders, and other parts get individually battered, they'll start visually breaking down and eventually breaking apart. And while it may be embarrassing to end up limping around on one leg, your mech's main gun arm having fallen onto the ground behind you like a piece of scrap, you can deal those same blows to your opponents. Your scanner will give you more specific damage readings, but the detailed destruction system means you can actually just see how much a mech is hurting. These mechs are also stomping machines, and pretty much anything below eye level can be plowed through. Bigger than that, you can try leveling obstacles flat to the ground with some well-placed shots instead, as buildings act as both cover and pinatas waiting to be cracked open. And it's not just you. Enemy missiles and cannons can cause as much friendly fire as a Pacific Rim Jaeger pilot saving a city from a kaiju. Yeah, good job protecting the one city block you didn't destroy yourself, Finn. We're all real proud. Shooting helicopters out of the air can even cause them to come spinning down onto a building for some spectacularly embarrassing collateral damage. But it's not just about blowing things to bits. Blasting a mech with a laser will superheat its metal armor in a way that's been modeled to work like it does in real life. Or would, if real life included giant superheating lasers strapped to walking tanks. In any case, where laser meets metal will begin to heat up and glow red hot, and even get brighter the longer you hold it in a single spot. Piranha tells me this is actually precise enough that you could tattoo your initials on your enemies, assuming they were patient enough to let you, which I doubt they are. Still, it's a small detail that adds a fair bit of visual depth to your less explosive options. And the visual damage your mechs take doesn't just stay on the battlefield either, though that arm you lost mid-fight definitely will. When you get back to your dropship, you can walk around on ground level and see all the damage that's been dealt to your precious death machines. Repairing them isn't just about filling up a health bar between missions, you'll actually be able to see those repairs play out as that atlas gets back in fighting shape. So there's a glimpse of the big booms you can expect in MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries. If you're sick of me talking but still want to see more explosions, and let's face it, who doesn't, you can check out Piranha's new symphonic montage of MechWarrior 5 destruction. And if you want even more mechs, check out our preview of MechWarrior Online's huge Solaris update. And for everything else, keep it right here on IGN.